welcome to Ryan's crib. So today I'm going to be giving you guys a tour of Ryan's nursery. So come on in. Alright, so we're going to start with the thing that is in the middle of the floor, and that's the largest. It is her crib. It is the Sophia Posh Circular Crib, I believe. Yeah. So, we found this crib on Wayfair originally, but Walmart.com did have it for a few bucks cheaper. So, we did end up getting it from there. Her bedding set is the Bacotti something. I don't know. Bacati something. Anything y'all want to know, I'll link it down below or you can just comment and I'll let you know what it is. But this is the Bacati bedding set. Now the trouble I did have with it is because the bedding set is of course supposed to be square. However, the bed is circular. So we had to go find custom sheets and etc. This is my favorite blanket. We're done with blankets, y'all. We don't even know more blankets. She does not need any more blankets. So, next thing, it did well. The bed did come with. Originally, I did not want the canopy on it. I just wanted the circular grill. But however, my mom taught me into putting the canopy on it, and we end up ordering the balances that actually supposed to go at the window. But I never liked it, so you know, putting it up here and it turned out cute. Perfect. Luckily, we were able to find sheets that matched her real daddy set, y'all. So, the next thing is her rocking chair. Um, The rocking chair was last minute. I originally did not want a rocking chair because, one, the room is small, as you can see. But, two, um, I just don't see myself sitting in a rocking chair. However, as the room started coming along, y'all, I was like, I want to just sit in here just rock and just take in all of this and I end up ordering a rocking chair and it came from Walmart so this is the comforter that goes with the um the baby set however I have it across the chair well I guess it's kind of like a reclining a recliner rocker but this one doesn't recline because the gliding ones yeah, I heard so much bad stuff about them. I don't want the um gliding rocking chair. I went with this kind. And I found it on Walmart.com. It came in two days. I think it was like $170. Let's just see. Next thing, her floating shelves or her um what do you call these shelves? Floating shelves. Um I just found this in bills the other day, and I think it was on sale for like $2 or something. So I was like, I'm gonna get it, of course. This little baby, that ain't mine. But we're gonna feel a change of faces as they go. Um, the floating shelves I found on Amazon.com, I think they were like $25. Um, this came in a basket. And then I'm gonna talk to you guys later about the um, baby monitor cam camera that I yeah. Next thing, my favorite, favorite, favorite thing in her room is her name on the wall. Y'all know I like to put my name everywhere, so I'm going to put her name everywhere. So, this came from 48 Hour Monograms. They kind of were just popping up on my Facebook, and when I clicked on them, um, I just got her name put on the wall. I could have just did the regular letters from, like, Michaels and spray painting them, but being that she has a boy name, I think her name needs to be written in cursive to make it soften it up. So I ended up purchasing this from 48 Hour Monogram and it was, I think, $94, $95 something like that. But you can pick your color, you can pick the font style, whichever print you would like and I ended up going with it. Now, her bassinet, this will not be in her room, this is actually going in my bedroom. It's Delta something bassinet. It seems it even has a light to like shine on her so I can see into the um, bassinet. It has music. I don't like that. I'm gonna sound like a circus. Too fast. That's it. That's how you go to 
I can go to sleep now. In her actual nursery, it's gonna be in my room. For the first three, four months, she will sleep in my room. Not in my bed, but in my room until she outgrows her next neck. And then we're gonna put her into her crib where she can sleep in her room by herself. Now that's the plan. I know everybody like, you know about it. You know about it. Her changing table. Um, I think we got this from Bed Bath and Beyond. It was on my registry, then it sold out, and we found it at Bed Bath and Beyond. Um, I'll link it down below. And here is her bath towels, um, bath rags. We done. She don't need no more, y'all. She has tons of rags. Um, washcloths. Um, but washcloths and the baby bath towel. She has tons of them. Of course, this is my favorite. Um, in here at the bottom, this will be one of her dirty clothes hampers because she also has another dirty clothes hamper that I like better than one y'all. But this is the one that came with the um changing table. So on this side of the changing table is going to be her bath stuff. This actually just came from somebody's individual. Y'all, and my cup is not wine. I just really like the cup, so I bought it. It's Arizona. It's, it's not you no know, alcohol in the cup. So I'm gonna get my backlash in the comments. This is gonna be all of her bath stuff. Um, wash. I am using Baby Dove. Everybody's like, um, how do I know she's gonna use Baby Dove? That is true. Baby Dove may still be too rough for her. Then I, I think my next choice is gonna be Avino. But Johnson and Johnson is a no. We're not using the Johnson and Johnson. Period. No. If y'all buy it, just get it. Send me a gift receipt so I can exchange it out. Cause I'm not even using Johnson and Johnson on me. So no. Um. That's going to be her laundry detergent down there. However, I don't want to use Dref, but somebody already done bought Dref. So, Dref is high. I wanted to use Baby All. Um, and I heard Baby All was good, but I guess we're going with Dref. So, whatever. <laughs> On this side is going to be diapers and wipes, if you can see. Um... Um, right here, also, I put this on this side of the crib because this is the diaper stack. I have not stacked any diapers in there. Except the ones that I've gotten for free, y'all. New moms or moms, period. Did y'all use this? Because I, I don't think I, I really wanted to take it back. The only reason I wanted to take it back is because my mom bought it. And I'm just like... Why we can't just fold a diaper up and put it in a bag and put it in church? And that's what they did in the old school. This was on my registry. These are just the elephant decals. They did not look like this on my registry. However, um, or on the picture on the registry. Um, so I kind of created my own design and placed them on the wall. Her curtains. The curtains did not come with the set. Also, the treasure pad did not come with the set they all this stuff was separate on my registry y'all um these curtains did not come with the set in the set the only thing that came was the sheet set the comforter the whatever this little thing called it got a name it came with that the diaper thing the crib bumper and one balance so we end up having about three balances in all the curtains i don't like short curtains so i went with the longer ones um in here so those were purchased separately from the actual set so i want to put the link down to where i got the bed set from however it didn't come with a lot of the stuff that you see it has to be bought separately and then we just put some gray shears in between and we did buy the pink shears if i felt like changing but I, this was the chest of drawer in my room um and I just kind of gave it to her because she would need drawers. But really, she don't even need it because they're empty. It's I don't know what. And she has a lot of storage. I do think I did good with storage. But in this one is a blanket. She don't need no more blankets. I think I got a car seat blanket. I got a house blanket. I got a to-go blanket. I have tons of swaddle blankets. Show that I'm 
them are blankets. Um, yeah, we done with those. And it's one over here, so yeah, we're we don't we good on blankets. In here are all of her pants. If y'all were in Walmart trying to find uh these pants, these little baby pants in any size. About every size because she's gonna need black pants every size, so yeah, they in her drawer. Um, and she also has different other little pants that goes with them. So, anyways, what I'm trying to say is this is her pants drawer. This is her onesie drawer, these are my favorite onesies right here. They're not hanging up because they didn't come hanging up, but these are my favorite, y'all. They have little tiny feet on them. So these are gonna be so cute when I made outfits out of them. The whole set is cute. I've found this new love for pink. Well, I don't for little girls. I don't like pink. And this one is so cute too. I think I'm gonna get this one. Um, what you call it? What is that one? Get where it's on? Monogram. And those other two drawers are completely empty. So I really, it's really an empty dresser because I could have put, it. that really don't have to be in here, honestly. So I might put it back in my room. All right, moving right along to her library. This is essentially supposed to be her library full of books. Yeah, but we have done good with books. So stuff like a hunt, my first 200 words. Um, because I know I'm going to teach you. I be seeing some don't know how to read. This one gonna read, okay? The crook. Um, read me 365 Bible stories. Most of them are like that. Count my blessings. This uh biblical baby book. I did find a princess one. I hope she eats the dog and stuff. What is she like Tonka trucks or something? I'm gonna be a hot mess. Well, anyway. All right, so this is supposed to be her reading area. This cubicle came from Home Depot. We ordered it, put it together. Um, I do want a TV right here, but everybody, no Brandy, no Brandy, don't worry about it. These cubicle um storage things came from Amazon, and this one is just her bibs, um, bibs and burping cloths. Um, are in this one. He knows that thing is a burping cloth. Is it a thing you throw across your shoulder to burp them? I thought they just threw a blanket across your shoulder. I didn't know it was. Yeah, I think you just grab what you can get. Cause if I'm in my room, I ain't coming in and get no burping cloth. Like, girl. In this one is her hair bow band. Lord, please let it have some hair. If not, she has bows in every color y'all can see also brushes and combs are in here um and these are headbands these aren't bows y'all these are the little headbands because if she ain't no hair ain't no purpose to have no headband so that's just like oh hats are in here too the what they call mom just told me what they call crater cap these cradle caps are in here. The little elephant, of course, came from Amazon. Um, and I love it. It's elephants. If y'all like to see the thing, you can grow elephants. Um, this one has bottles in it. I am only using Dr. Brown's bottles, y'all. Dr. Brown. And the reason I mean is because I have the Dr. Brown's bottle warmer. However, I've seen it does warm um pretty much all bottles because i do have a little a vino bottle in here and it fits in there like this is so cute i think i have a little tummy so no not a vino it's a zinc a zinc whatever this one i heard that good bottles i just went with dr brown's bottles this one was free but this is done with newborn bottles. We don't need no more. These are the Lancino. I think these are, this is the brand of my breast pump. And my line sister really wanted me to try these. So I am gonna try it. Because technically this is the brand of my um, breast pump. 
Do you know how to eat rice milk? Cause I've seen it already come out. I don't know. How you do it? This is gonna be her shoe bin. Cause her mama got shoes. So far in here, she got some boots for the winter, I guess. I don't know, they were like $2. Um, these are so cute. They go with the little outfit that I cannot wait for her to wear. And I think these are going to be for her coming home outfit. If they're not to be, if not, I got some real cute socks that she can come home in. And this one right here is her socks. Um, her socks being. I just realized like last week or a week or two ago that babies need socks because their feet can't just be out like I don't know what made me realize that but anyway this basket came from my co-worker shout out to Scott Horton and Baker they made it and I'm not gonna open it up like I looked at the sizes so that's what 18 months so technically I don't have to open it for a year anyway my sure the shoe on the shoe is 3 feet so well, it's so pretty, I don't want to open it. Like, so it's for right now, as you're going to see here. I don't have no purpose to open it. It's pretty. It's pretty decoration. Her grandmama wanted to be so extra and said, every baby has this toy. And she wanted to be the first person to buy her first toy. This say 12 months. So it's going to be sitting here for a year before she can play with it. Well, another storage thing. Um, these are her binkies, pacifiers, whatever y'all say. Actually, don't want her to have binkies and pacifiers. <laughs> she don't want her to have binkies and pacifiers. She's not really gonna mess up her teeth, but honey, she crying. You gotta, you gotta shut up. So, no more pacifiers, just because I have a ton of them. And this one more still in here, and. Most of those were free or somebody that gave them to me. I think I saw one in there. We don't need no more. However, this is going to be my favorite one. Um, It is a elephant toy. Um, But it's a pacifier on it as well. She will not have this as a newborn because this is too big to be a newborn. So maybe when she gets like one or two months, I'll then start giving it to her. Right, as a newborn, that's too much on her face. I don't want to suffocate. Well, it was on my registry. Shout out to her TT Tasia, my line sister. She got off my registry. That's the go. These are some bottle bottle cleaners, nasal aspirator in here. These are going to be the bags for the diaper genie. This is the decal. I didn't put all this stuff up. Sheets for her crib and her bassinet. So, finally, her closet. Oh, one thing, y'all. Um, The stuff on the walls. The first thing is her clock. My mom got her this clock. I don't know where she got it from. But it is an elephant clock. with Amazon. Amazon. It is elephant clock. I think it's acrylic with her name on it. Her name is like a boy name when you write it like that. But it's still cute. But that's why I said we're going to write her name in cursive always. Because... To be cursed to the black girl. Then, over here on this wall, when you first come in her room, um, this was from Ross, and I think it was like six dollars. Everybody hates it, but I really like it. It's a baby elephant. She is a baby elephant. Whatever. These three things right here came with the um nursery set, the Bacardi nursery set, and I just placed them on the wall with some. Um, double sided command strips. If y'all are wondering what this door is, it's just to the bathroom. She, it's just a guest bathroom. And she's not going to use the bathroom. So I don't have it decorated. I was going to decorate it as if it was her bathroom, but by the time she started using the bathroom, my lease going to be up, so I don't plan on staying here. So it's the guest bathroom. I decorated it as a guest bathroom. This door just is how you get the regular way which will be blocked off with the baby gate i just have it down right now now last things last is her closet um and voila this is the closet don't pay attention to the storage containers they're empty i just have 
taking him to what he did. Just bought some empty too. I just haven't taken him right So her clothes are sized with these sizes that were on my um, baby registry. These are, they come like zero to three months, three to six. Basically how clothes are. These are newborn. I'm done with newborn clothes, y'all. I say this every time I go in the store and buy something else newborn. Done with newborn. Um, yeah. Her coming home outfit has not came yet. They tried to put bring my baby home in these, y'all. It's not ugly. I like it, but it's a onesie. Like, what are you talking about? She can put it on when she gets to the house, but y'all gonna dress my baby up. Y'all gonna see her um coming home outfit. I do a vlog of that once I do my um what's in her nursery bag and what's in my bag for the hospital. So next thing, zero to three months. I'm pretty much done with zero to three months, y'all, because all of this is zero to three months. This is so cute. One of her great grandmas just bought this. And it is so cute, Fabulous like side mommy. I really don't care for stuff to say mommy, daddy. And all that stuff, but y'all want some little auntie stuff and stuff. That's fine, but whatever. I just don't care to buy stuff this. Save money and daddy. This came out of Walmart and it was so cute. And I can't wait to put her on it with some red socks and a red head. Like, Another one is really cute to me. This one, it has elephants on it. She has so much stuff with elephants on it, so thank y'all for sticking to the code. Like, thank y'all. This is a little elephant um bath robe. Any cute? Good bath robe. Period. So, but that's being said, her clothes are sized, and y'all are still sending stuff, my friends and family. So thank y'all so much. What is it called? My bad. I had to grab when I go. To, when I get ready to go in, and these are using. Um, this is her laundry basket, the one that I'm actually going to use. It does have pink and white elephants on it. Her diapers, we're done with newborn um diapers. I do have sizes one and sizes three. So I am asking if you do want to buy her diapers or purchase her diapers size two and up. These are her first, some of her first toys. Y'all be careful with these because I just can't have all this much clothes over there. Last thing, um, this is the baby bather. This is the one that goes into the kitchen sink when they're super, super small. I don't have the bathtub, the actual bathtub that sits in the tub yet i still do need one of those but it says from ages of birth until sitting up unassisted that means they sit up by the door unassisted um so yeah i still need the next step which is the big one so this is like the kitchen sink bath this is the breast pump that i am using if I can breastfeed, hopefully I can. It's the Lancino Smart Pump. I did get it through my insurance um, for free. So please check with your insurance. You can get, y'all, breast pumps are expensive. I think this one retails for almost $200. Buy the junk on your insurance card. Like, put it on your insurance. This one is a smart pump. I am a 90s baby. Technology, everything. I know I need the Lancino app for this one um and that the count of what is it called the baby monitor which we're gonna go back to that in a second but um this is the lesson smart pump i heard great reviews about this and so it's between this one and the Modelo. but i went with this one because this one was a smart pump I also have the breast milk storage bags to it. So once you pump, put it in a bag, you can put them in the freezer. So maybe, yeah, you have to eat up breast milk because some people freeze it. Anyways, I have learned that you can freeze baby milk up to a year. It can sit in a refrigerator for either six weeks or six months. I have to go back to it. Yeah. Newy camera or newy something. Yeah, it's so cool. It's very dope. 
um i can share the camera with anybody it can be um I'm gonna show y'all a little clip later. It, it can move. I can sit, set it to motion detect it, um, where it would follow her around the room if she's playing. Um, I can move the camera and change it to any size. It's not 360, but it doesn't need to be 360 because it was 360. I've been seeing a wall. Um, but it does cover every angle of the room, and it goes like to the ceiling, to the floor. I can zoom in. Um, it automatically switches to night camera. It's very cool. I really like it. Um, so, so far with that, that's a thumbs up. Oh, and I can speak through it through my app. Um, and they can speak to me back through it. So, it's super cool. Super sweet. So, that is the end of this vlog, you guys. Welcome to Ryan's Nursery Crib. I am currently 32 weeks out of five days. So I'll be 33 weeks in a couple of days. And I have a doctor's appointment on that day. So I will be taking y'all along because my students ask to go. I don't know why they like going to the doctor. But they ask to go. So I'm gonna do a 33 week um, doctor check up. My baby shower was canceled, but as you can see, baby girl ain't lacking for nothing. So if you just wanna see something, we are more than thankful for it. I'm beyond thankful for my family, my friends. However, y'all still been sending the gifts for my Amazon registry, which is linked below. I don't really use the Target one, so if you do want to purchase something off of there, um, be sure that you contact me first to make sure I don't already have it um, from another registry. Other than that, that wraps up this vlog. See you guys in the next one. I love you. Bye.